A few weeks ago, I did a story titled Rose Coco for Politicians. The story exposed how politicians are paying hundreds of thousands of money in exchange for Rose Coco pleasure. This story featured a lady called Dick Munto. So Dick Munto is the link between politicians and the ladies who are willing to offer Rose Coco services. Dick Munto manages a WhatsApp group called City Girls. So when a politician wants a lady, he contacts Dick Munto and then gives her the description of the lady that he wants. Dick Munto then goes to her WhatsApp group and finds a lady who fits the description and then links her to the politician. According to the details that we received and then and which we showed in the previous episode, some of the ladies are earning up to a hundred thousand shillings just for a one session of Rose Coco Pleasure. Today, we will be talking to D. Camunto to find out the details of this business operation and also to find out if the exposure of the story has affected their business in any way. I had called her earlier on, but she was not uh, at a place where she could speak. So she told me to call her back 10 minutes later. It's been 20 minutes. So let me call her and see if we can talk. I really hope she's now in a position to speak because at that time she was in a noisy place. So let's see. Dial one one for one shilling and fifty cents daily. All right. Hello. Hello. Hey, Mambo D. Hey. Uko in a position to talk, Sasa. Yeah, I'm dressing up for Sunday. Oh, pole pole for interfering, but I'll just need a few minutes to Okay. okay. Sasa D, <laughs> when we talked about the story at Rosgogo for politicians, people were shocked. Why? Well, you can say, there is no way people can be earning such amount of money, you know, like, it was like uh, almost kitu hawa, kuna mtu alianza expecting za kwe nafanyika. Ah, unajua, kama, nivenye tu na mdu wangu kawi jui chums, una pangu na mingi. Mm-hmm. So, uh, hii ni kitu hiko, you know, kuna hao watu wanajua kuspend. Aha. Uh, kuna kuwesti ana time, so, it's real, it's real. Hakuna uongo hapo anything. So, to clarify, this business actually does exist? Yeah, it does. For how long have you been doing this? I'm curious. Let's say, vizuri, vizuri, that's like, um, since 2022, mm-hmm. uh, Feb, mm-hmm. to now. Well, 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 well. How much do you make approximately in a month well when you personally? Oh, um, let's say uh, at least um, nothing less than 300. 300k? Yeah. In a month? Yeah, like, Manze... Sometimes you get more, sometimes you get less, you know. Manze adi kuna ma government jobs as ilipi that much, ban. <laughs> <laughs> And but the, the, the question in your saying you are nayo and 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 if you're not comfortable answering, uh, it's okay. The question in your saying you are nayo is, are you at peace at the end of the day after doing all that? Like, you're at peace with yourself? Which one be at peace? Peace over what? So you are looking for money. Uh-huh. Yeah? Sometimes people are even in uncomfortable workplaces now. Attack if they are not in peace at mm-hmm. peace. So, you can make money, do it. You are not uh, breaking families or anything. Mm-hmm. Eh. Now, the publicity surrounding this story in your effect in any way? Actually, no. Me, I'm that one nonchalant person. Me, I couldn't do. So long as my family is okay, mm-hmm. my friends are okay, mm-hmm. my loved ones are okay, I couldn't do me in an insumbua. So like right now, uh uko 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 una manage madem wangapi and city girls. Okay, so we have uh, three active groups. Mm-hmm. Uh, one is VIP, mm-hmm. second is VIP girls, mm-hmm. it's called City VIP girls, mm-hmm. and the other one is uh, recently, it's new, it's called City girls, that came, uh, it's just uh, the second City girls now, mm-hmm. after the first one, 
Mm. So that's and that's uh, let's say in total I have like uh, 600. What the Nyasita. Nyasita. Wee. Like how many sit on operates to within Nairobi or any country wide? Ah uh, no, tuko na from Nigeria, tuko na uh, mostly Nigeria, Kenya. Uh-huh. Kenya, Kenya na part part like kuna Kuru, kuna Kisumu, Mombasa, Meru, Ibo. We 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 it's a whole network. Yeah, they are, we are all over. Na by the way, madam wengi by the way wali ni DM like kila mahali Instagram madam you know alikuwa na Nicole. They want to know how they can join. They had some people from as far as Uganda DMing me wanataka kujua how they can join. You know that's now the problem because mm-hmm. uh, I can't promise that I would, I would take people you know like this second city girl she me kuja sasa after the exposal thing mm-hmm. uh, so hiyo ndo nilikuwa like I went to my platform to talk nikaonga nikaonga na madem and I was like uh we can just put a second city girl sikwe to have just in case ladies want to help each other connect each other mm-hmm. go uh, do these hustles together so hiyo hiyo second city girls it's just there for basics Hakuna ati out literally give you someone from there unless nimekuangalia profile background check mm-hmm. then as a person na kuweka kwa VIP Oh and by the way some something about background check which brings me like uh kulikuwa na concerns pia like how do you assure security ya yeah, dem unajua like mkifika nga huko you never know especially kuna wengine wajui so unaensure yeah. aje security of your clients and peer security of the people working under you okay for me to start this at least i had trust from the guys mhm uh it took long but at least i they trust me now mm-hmm. so about the ladies the men said there's no problem mm-hmm. about the ladies um don't know ina kwa ngumu sasa sasa hii mtu akisema ati you unataka ku join mhm and here the sacrifices we made to get there mhm see it yet our the girls in group at walingia to and they got people mm-hmm. we had to meet first get to know each other hang out more and stuff mhm and um, na kuangalia tu from afar na kujua i also have to know what you're doing mhm um uh, health wise i have to check mhm um, una issue wapi background yako like homestead and stuff just in case of anything mm-hmm. yeah and then once i like um i trust you a bit then now i'm able to try and connect you ukienda ya kwanza we see things are okay now you are mm-hmm. vvip oh oh so ni kind of a promotion unaanza nga down ukipandango yeah. kipandango kifika vvip uko more yeah. trusted than the others All of them were in the city girls like it was basic so city uh-huh. girls it was just there the city girls had 900 ladies where so from there and to get vip mm-hmm. now we have that serious vip and the vvip that's the only two groups that are serious mhm na sasa like ever since mwanze his staff mshai kuwa na any unforeseen security issue enye au uko me plan yes you took all the precautions but just them alienda huko and then something ika happen ika kwa a whole case uh yeah we've had such cases not one two three mm-hmm. ziko but um you know ukienda ngoku nje pia kufanya mambo zako ina kwa 50 50 kwa gi guaranteed that you're going to it's to have it all mm-hmm, mm-hmm. sometimes the men disappoint but sometimes most of the times the ladies tend to disappoint more oh so like them anafika huko na ana change mind no not in terms of uh, changing mind mhm uh-huh. There are some demands some some ladies that we didn't trust actually they are more of when you expose you know uh-huh. um unafika huko they agreed amount to go and change unaenda kuleta drama and you know these people are these prominent people they don't want to be like all over uh-huh. or use uh-huh. their power to do you shit mhm wala kwa tuko kwa district in that way but uh oh. ladies you need to enjoy your trust uh-huh. they go do shit they go like uh Mm-hmm. At some point when I lay away and uh, begin to break things mm-hmm. before. Mm-hmm. And oh. also we've had cases of uh, ladies being uh, you know kasi ya kupea yenyewe hiyo many rape. Oh yeah yeah by the way. Yeah. Uh-huh. So mshai kwa na case kama hiyo. Yeah we've had like uh, three or four cases. 
哦